वेलकम टू एनजी क्लासेस यूट्यूब चैनल इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू कंसीडर वन ऑफ द इंपॉर्टेंट प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ डीएफटी व्हिच इज सिमेट्री ऑफ रियल वैल्यू डे सीक्वेंसेस आई वुड स्ट्रांगली रेकमेंड यू टू वॉच दिस वीडियो टिल द एंड सो दैट आई एम गोइंग टू रिवील अ सीक्रेट ऑफ फाइंडिंग डीएफटी इन अ मच इजियर वे हाउ इज इट पॉसिबल से फॉर एग्जाम्पल आई हैव टू फाइंड द डी ऑफ टेन पॉइंट आई नीड टू फाइंड टेन पॉइंट डी I have to find only DFT of six points, and the remaining four points could be found using making use of this property. That is why this property is very important. Uh, the significance of this, uh, we shall say it now. So, if I want to define uh, the property of this symmetric property, if the sequence x of n, the sequence x of n, which is defined for n equal to zero, one, two, till n minus one, if this sequence is real. so for example if this sequence is a real what do you mean by x of n being real uh, that means it can take only real values so for example x of n is equal to 1 2 3 4 something like this it it can take only real values if it is real then its dft is given by then its dft is given by x of k is equal to x star of n minus k so this is what the definition of uh, symmetry property and this is defined for k equal to 0 1 2 0 n minus 1 so how do i prove this so this is the definition how do i prove that so if i want to start with the proof i would write we know that x of k what is x of k x of k is nothing but dft dft of what the sequence x of n so what is the definition of this I know the formula for this summation n equal to zero to n minus one x of n w n to the power k into n. So this is the definition of uh, uh, DFT of any given sequence. So now if I look at the definition, one of the terms R H S has the star. Star is nothing but conjugate, complex conjugate. So what I do now is I'll take taking conjugate i would write taking conjugate on both sides so let's see that take complex conjugates on both sides it becomes x star of k x of k would become now x star of k summation n equal to 0 to n minus 1 x of n w n to the power k n whole to the power star so i would take it inside this becomes x star of n W n to the power k n becomes W n to the power minus k n. So this we know it because this is a complex uh, number and uh, its uh, conjugate becomes W n to the power minus k n. So next, proceeding further, we know that x of n is real. Hence, I could write x star of n also equal to x of n. Is it correct? So I could write this. only if and only if x of n is real and we have defined that x of n is uh, real what do you mean by that if i take uh, complex conjugate of any real sequence it still turns out to be real number only it has the conjugate has its effect only on imaginary numbers real numbers will remain as they are hence i would write n equal to 0 to n minus 1 x star of n now it is only x of n W n to the power minus k n, is it correct? So in the next step, I'll multiply this with one of the factors. So what is that factor? So I'll uh, keep this step till W n to the power minus k n as it is. So now I would multiply this with the W n to the power capital n and a small n. So what is this factor? So if I'm multiplying uh, this term with uh, uh, one of the factors. making sure that that factor is a 1 w n to the power capital n into small n this this must be 1 so how it is 1 i have made a one more video on this i would recommend you to stop at this point and uh, watch that video and come back uh, if we know it already how this is 1 it is well and good so now what i do is summation n equal to 0 to n minus 1 x of n so here w n to the power So I can take something out here. Uh, I'll take small n out. I am left with capital n minus k. So this is what I am left with now. So what is this point? This is nothing but 
x of did the dft dft of what n minus k uh, this is with respect to whatever term i have here so this will be dft of this so what did i prove now x star of k is equal to x of n minus k is that okay this is defined this way or it is also defined as x of k is equal to x star of n minus k so how do i prove this take uh, conjugate one more time x star of k to the power star it becomes x of k which is equal to x star of n minus k so both can be proved so this is how i proved it mathematically so what is what is the significance of this this is why i said uh, watch this video till the end so now uh, we'll see uh, the significance of this conceptually the equation conveys the message that dft of a real sequence possesses conjugate symmetry about the midpoint this is what uh, this is important this is what i was uh, saying midpoint this possesses conjugate symmetry about the midpoint what do you mean by this so for example the midpoint of the sequence x of k is at uh, k equal to n by 2 i would say k equal to n by 2 the midpoint how do i find the midpoint divided by 2 the index k is known as the folding index k i call it as the folding index and if i want to illustrate this i would uh, do it uh, this way so for example i have got uh, seven point dft and i would indicate the same thing over here seven point this is zero one two three four five six as it is seven point dft i have drawn a seven point zero to six it makes seven what is the folding index here k equal to n by two what is n by two seven by two what is that equal to 3.5 so what does it say this uh, dft of this is symmetric about the point at 3.5 what do you mean by that the point lying left to that is conjugate symmetric about to its right that is x of 3 is equal to x star of k similarly x of 2 is nothing but x star of 5 and similarly x of 1 is nothing but x star of 6 so what does it mean if it is 7 point dft as it is 7 point dft i need to find only x of 0 x of 1 x of 2 and x of 3 the remaining points which are nothing but x of 4 so i would write it here x of 4 x of 5 and lastly x of 6 are conjugate symmetric conjugate symmetric about the midpoint so i need to find only dft of these things whatever i'm left with the dft of these points can be found making use of the symmetry property so this is what it is a conceptual thing so if i want to understand this i'll consider one of the numericals and it is uh, very easier to understand and appreciate this uh, property which is nothing but symmetry of real valued sequences hope you have understood if there are any doubts please let me know in the comment section uh, comment section thanks for watching